In this video, I'm unboxing and taking a look at this really cool Yakao selfie stick. Hey everybody, this is Andrew from T is for Tech. And today I am taking a look at this uh, tripod selfie stick from a company called Yakao. I think that's how it's pronounced. It's Y-O-K-K-A-O. -K -K um, and basically this is a, what would you think, right? It's a selfie stick. Um, but what's kind of nice about it is it has a tripod base. Um, and it also has an adapter for a GoPro. Um, so you can kind of handle both a cell phone and a GoPro with the selfie stick. So I'm going to do an unboxing and take, take a quick look at this. Okay, so uh, it's waterproof. You can rotate uh, the phone 360 degrees. has an aluminum telescoping rod, uh, the wireless Bluetooth wireless remote, and a tripod. So this is kind of like an all-in-one everything um, for, for your... Um, um, for your phone if you're looking for a selfie stick. So we will open this up. Okay, so right away there's a micro USB cable included and then the tripod itself. Um, so as you can see um, this is the um, the holder at the top. It's kind of like one of those um, spring-based deals, right? So put your phone in, and it kind of clamps it, and you can turn it you turn it all the way around, right? That's pretty cool. Um, so this this part of the selfie stick is on a little bit of a uh, swivel and you can tighten it up using this little side thing. You can also spin this around and it locks um, as you can see so you can kind of rotate that thing that you can rotate the top and it locks and then you know the selfie stick itself telescopes out pretty far as you can see right and it's a kind of a darker um, anodized aluminum, so it looks nice. And it's nice because it you know, telescopes in a few different sections. And it feels pretty high quality. Um, it doesn't feel cheaper at all. Um, and what's cool here, too, is that you can see the, uh, the remote. You can see the light or not. I guess it's in Bluetooth pairing mode now, so I'll have to pair it with my phone. Um, but the remote <clears throat> is here, and you can also detach it. So you can have the remote separate from the stick or kind of stored in, in the stick itself, which is pretty nice. Um, and then the bottom, as you can see, then flips out, and there's a tripod. So very, very convenient if you're uh, kind of into traveling a lot and you need to set your, and you want to use your phone or GoPro on, you know, this sort of mount and you want to set it down, you don't have to lay it down, you can set it on the tripod and that just kind of snaps back together. Um, seems like there's magnets on the end. Um, it kind of keeps that keeps these together when you're not um, you're not using it in tripod mode. So nice handle, convenient button placement there. Yeah, so so that's that. Now they also give you in the package um, a Yakao branded uh, micro, micro, micro fiber cloth. Um, and they also give you like this silky smooth looking uh, storage bag. So you can use this bag to kind of store um, the selfie stick when you're not using it. So that's nice. And so then 
what they give you as well um, is an additional um, an additional clamp um, for the end of this where you can replace this piece with this. So you basically unscrew this screw here, this screw, and then you can screw it into this and then they give you um, the adapter for the GoPro. So this is a typical tripod mount GoPro adapter uh, and that guy would just kind of, um, you know, screw onto this and then this goes on the top of the selfie stick. So we'll try both of these scenarios. So I've got my iPhone XS Max. We'll kind of sync this guy up. Shows up as Yakao V1. Let's click that guy. It's connected. White is blue. It's connected. So you can see T is for tech. Take a picture. You see, see that? So I pressed the button and it took a picture. So that works. I don't think there's a way to reverse the camera at all um, using this. So if you want to do selfie, then obviously, hi, look at, you can see, oh, that's, that's great, selfie, selfie camera. Um, yeah. So what, what I like um, about, this, it, about this is that this is a sturdy um, telescoping pole. So it doesn't, even with the weight of iPhone XS Max and, and the Spigen Tough Armor case, um, this doesn't feel like flimsy, right? Um, so I would, I would feel pretty confident that my, the phone's not going to fall off. I guess basically that's what I'm trying to say. Um, so that's nice. And then you could you know, put it down. Um, so then you can see, right? So you have the tripod. All right, so that's that. So we'll take off the phone. And then we'll put the other piece on. So this is pretty simple. You just unscrew this. Take off the smartphone clamp. All right, so so now on the on the, now you have the um, GoPro adapter, which then you can kind of snug up. So there you go. So now GoPro is mounted, and this can all I mean obviously be adjusted. Different um, setups, and center, and then you also have your tripod. Um, yeah, so all in all, this is pretty, uh, I think this is really useful. Um, I like the fact that um, you have both adapters. So if you want to use your smartphone, you want to use your GoPro, um, you can do that. You have a lot of adjustment, adjustability on how, um, you know, how, how this thing uh, behaves um, just by adjusting the angles of the connectors and all of that. So it's pretty cool. Um, the built-in shutter release for the, for the smartphone is nice. The ability to kind of pop that out, use it in your hand, also nice. Um, if you can use that and, and, for instance, put it on a tripod, go back, take your picture with everybody in the photo, which is, which is pretty nice. So if you're interested in something like this, um, be, it's beyond just a standard uh, kind of generic selfie stick that you might find, um, a cheap one. Uh, this is very sturdy. Um, Bluetooth um, enabled uh, shutter release, tripod base, uh, does work for smartphones and GoPros. I think it's a solid buy. I'll link uh, to this in the description. Again, this is Andrew from Tia's for Tech. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.